Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Jordan Ari here, and as you can tell from the title of this video, I am about to go to Peru, and I am going to Peru for eight days and packing it all in a 65 liter book bag. This is gonna be a challenge for me, considering I'm usually a super heavy packer, but I have to pack light because, honey, I'm gonna be bag lady. This book bag is gonna be on my back, and I'm not trying to hurt my back. I'm gonna listen to Erica Badu and not carry too much baggage, too many unnecessary items. So I'm gonna try and pack light and efficient so that I can get it all in this book bag and not be struggling the whole time I'm in Peru. Little side note, I don't like to check bags when I travel. One time we had a super hard time finding our luggage after we got back and that was just super stressful, so annoying. I was just getting back from out of the country for 10 days and I was like, okay, I want my stuff and I'm ready to go home. Like I'm tired, I've been traveling for two days. So ever since then, I've only been carry on, carrying on luggage. So packing everything in a carry on is not new, it's just the whole backpack aspect, which is new for me. So we'll see how this goes. Let's get into this packing video. Okay guys, it's just me down here on the floor packing. <laughs> the floor seems to be my happy space. But I am bringing four pair of leggings slash joggers as well as one pair of jeans. And I am gonna roll them all up and place these guys at the bottom of my book bag. I felt like they're the most bulky so I went ahead and started with them. Next, I am packing my shirts. I have nine t-shirts total, and of these shirts, I have four that are a long sleeve. And look at Milo, he's in here trying to pack with me. I just wanna put them in my book bag and take them with me to Peru. Too bad he can't come. He's gonna be staying with my parents for the week while I'm gone, and I'm sure he's gonna be really excited I'm packing these long sleeve shirts because it's actually going to be cold in Peru. They are on the opposite side of the equator so it is winter for them and the high for most days is about 68 degrees and I'm always cold so I want to make sure I'm playing it safe by wearing long sleeve t-shirts. Alright now that I've stuffed all of these shirts in there I am going to grab my two kind of sweatshirt like things this first pink one isn't really that thick it's actually a really really thin kind of top but I also have my gray sweatshirt whenever I travel I always bring towels and washcloths of my own this time I went out and bought a new pack of washcloths that way I can throw them away as I go I really really hate keeping wet washcloths with me and that way I can use a new one on my face every single day. I am also bringing a pair of tennis shoes. That's actually the only pair of shoes that I'm packing as well as this purse which I can keep my camera and snacks in it. As you can see I have my almonds and my peanut butter crackers. I told you guys I get hangry so I need stuff to keep me going. Also, I have sunglasses and, of course, Rice Krispie Treats, and then my phone charger, as well as my camera charger and battery, and some other miscellaneous items. Next, in my Victoria's Secret makeup kind of cosmetic-like bag, I have my makeup and then everything that I will need as far as medicine. I have Dramamine, Alka-Seltzer, Omeprazole for my acid reflux and Advil. Of course, wet ones and Clorox wipes, um, sunscreen, toothbrush, toothpaste, deodorant, makeup, all that good stuff lives in this bag here. Trying to pack it as efficiently as possible, so putting as much as I can in this bag and making it fit. As you guys can see in there, there's some toilet paper. I heard that in Peru, there's often times where there will be no toilet paper, so I just decided to bring some. But actually, I took that out of my suitcase because I figured I can just use napkins and like keep some of those in my purse. Then I have my blanket. If you guys saw my 50 Facts video, I'm obsessed with blankets. I have to travel with one.
And then I have my neck pillow, which I'm going to clip on the top of my book bag. And that is it for what's going in the book bag. I am keeping all of my undergarments in this little bottom pouch. And the last thing that I have is my bomber jacket. I'm just going to be wearing that, so I won't be putting that in my book bag. But I wanted to bring it just because it's going to be a little chilly since it's technically Peru's winter. And of course I need my essentials, which are my phone, headphones, and passport. All right guys, I am all finished packing. I am super excited to get on the road, head to Pittsburgh, and get out of here and get on to Peru. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to give it a thumbs up if you did. Comment down below and let me know where you're going next, whether it be outside of the country or just somewhere local. Share it with me, I'm so interested to hear. I love traveling and exploring new places and I wanna share that with you guys. And also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Click subscribe to join the click, it's that easy. Can't wait to see you guys in my next video, probably a Peru vlog or something along that lines. But until next time, I'll see you guys later, bye.